How's it going, man? It's uh, it's going great. This is the best city. I'm having a blast at this festival. It's like a camp for comedians. Yeah, that's yeah. what everyone says. Yeah, it really is. It's. It, I feel like in our respective cities, you know, at the clubs, we're all kind of, you know, workshopping and it's its own energy but here we're all just happy to be out of where we're from and right. and just getting along with each other in a really great way and it's just it's the best that's awesome i love it now uh it's saturday night what would you be doing if you were on snl right now well, tell me walk me through it you'd be uh, doing rehearsal or? um yeah i i think uh what time what time is it right now i guess we'd be about seven. Seven, yeah, seven yeah. we'd be getting into hair and makeup yeah. for uh, the dress rehearsal. Yeah. So I would probably be pacing uh, <laughs> nervously, maybe uh, call my mom. Right. And, Is that uh, something you do? <laughs> I've stopped. <laughs> I've, I've, I've had to stop, you know, right, right. a little bit, uh, much to her chagrin. But uh, <laughs> I think, uh, I, you know, you don't have time to – what's good about that uh, – uh, gig is uh, it doesn't force you to it do, you don't have enough time to really think too much right. or, or be too nervous because right. it could be like hey we need you to do a Russian accent uh, figure it out right. you got this amount of time how do you develop an impression um, is it listening over and over is it picking up ticks? yeah is I think it... a lot of times the ones that I do well just come easy I just right. have them in me innately there are some people like on the show like Jay and Taryn who are so good and meticulous about yeah. impressions and I'm always picking their brain because now I have to learn ones that I don't have in my repertoire. Now you're you know? assigned one. Yeah, you're assigned one and you've got zero time to figure it out. And so what do you do? I panic. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I figure it out. I just I yeah. click uh, on YouTube videos and I watch and I try to get something down but um, a buddy of mine, uh, this guy Jonathan Kite, uh, kind of gave me advice when I was auditioning and I was trying to come up with a Bernie Sanders impression, these impressions I didn't have. Uh, he said, if you give them context, then they'll come to you easier. If you just try to, you know, if you just try to pronunciate sounds, it doesn't come as easy. And I found that that's true, actually. So with Bernie Sanders, I did uh, just him, um, him doing an ad for KFC. And suddenly I had him, you know, a little bit, you know, a version of him, a ridiculous version. But I was like, for a limited time, we're offering you the Bernie bucket. Comes with a single drumstick. That is to be equally divided and distributed amongst you with your family, you know. And then uh, it just kind of came to me once I, once I had the premise in my head, which I think kind of worked for me, yeah. as opposed to just trying to say what he would say.